You're going to find her ring. You're going to be her hero. And you're going to get the damn power turned back on around here. Now, what do you want? Uh, Mr. Ives, where did you get that ring? What's it to you? I I'll buy it from you. How much do you want for it? You can't even afford your power bill, let alone a diamond ring. That's the utility bill. That payment's on time and it's all there. Now, how much do you want for the ring? What is your interest, boy? A girl that came to the theater lost her ring at a show a week ago. It was a gift from her mother. She got it when she was very young. It's very special to her. We searched all over for it, but we couldn't find it. But now, well, it's right there. Oh, I see. I mean, I've never dated a guy that I had to drive home before, so. <laughs> Cars are scary and expensive. And my mom wanted her van back, so. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, it's a good different. Are you sure you wanna? I, it's just, it's the first date. Shut and I up, you goof. <laughs> We both know it really wasn't working. It wasn't. That's not how I felt. And since you felt that way, you should have told me, but you didn't. Instead, you went ahead and moved on like I didn't exist. Alan, he was just a friend. Then why were you kissing him? I can't believe you. Me? You're on the other side of the country playing private investigator. How do you even know Courtney and why are you following her? All right, her? fine, whatever. It doesn't matter, all right? It's fine, whatever. Sorry, whatever, I don't up. care. I didn't, I didn't mean it like that. I don't I, care. I, I, I wasn't trying to. Well, you know what, Madeline? No, just, it's, just it's, let it's, me it's fine. Explain, it's okay? fine. It's, it's over. No, no, please don't hang up on me. Goodbye, please. Madeline. Oh, please.